absolute bastard. I mean, seriously, you just don't say shit like that. Armor? The fuck was that? So... Oh, okay, that's just opened up. Ugh, this is like fear all over again. With breathing, the... Oh man, that scent chills right up me. Right up my crack. Hmm. Oh. Stupid sod. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Uh. Come on, hit him, hit him. Beat him. Fucking beat down. Hundred and fifteen armor, sixty one health. We could do some oh there we go. Speaking of help. Oh how's it feel to be faceless? Oh shit. Hmm. Yeah. So where did that guy come? Oh. Must have opened up then. What a mess. lucky before he got a shot off. Can we access this door? No. I, fuck, I don't want to access that door now. Screw that, we'll go another way. Oh, shit. I kind of expected him to come through the glass, but... ACO card. Ugh, means we can access that door. Specialist Wilson, this is Sergeant Kelly. Stay sharp, son. Look to your last known RP and fortify your position. We'll find you. And by will, he he means us because he's cooped up in a fucking secure bunker somewhere, likely with a cup of coffee. Oh shit. Ah. Oh, hey, you missed that one, didn't you, bitch? Oosh! Ah. What do we got in here? Nothing. Armor and help. Can you shoot through? Oh, hey! Shit, are we gonna have to kill that little thing now? Why? Why? What's your what's your excuse? Reasoning. Oh, it's faceless again. You dirty, dirty bastards! Shit. Oh, I mean, come on. It's, it's just the enemy placement that gets me, man. Like Shells, thank you. Hmm. The wall is talking to us. Oh, fuck. Fucking bitch has got a pace, mate. Fuck. 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 Okay, you need to, you need to piss right off. Seriously, you creepy bitch. Ah, uh, take a flashing. Make me put my trench coat on. <laughs> Friendly or foe? I'm saying foe. I'm saying foe. Oh, fuck's sake, you bastard! That was a miss, completely. Oh, shit. Oh, we're getting fucking hammered. Get the fuck out of my way, fat cum. Oh, no. Shit. 
I mean, this is ridiculous. <laughs> I realise I used the um, C word. I do apologise. That, that was like a spare of the moment, oh my god, kind of thing. I'm not really worried about armour, I need help. Um. Hmm. Infirmary. Oh, yes. Suck that juice right up. Hmm. Right. Um. See, there's a locker here. Now, for anyone that doesn't know, these lockers contain, like, health and... Ammunition, weapons, all that kind of stuff. Really helpful stuff. But you have to have a passcode to access them. Or access. Access? What's access? Access them. This is Grant Baston, your environmental services. Now, sometimes in these messages. The date is October 19th. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some uh, unexplainable things. What is that noise? Being on another planet and working underground has always been a little spooky. So we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. The power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. Mm -hmm. I'm doing my best to keep people in track. It's not convincing, we're is it? We're continually shorthanded. Someone's reporting in sick almost every day. I'll keep my director apprised of the situation. And we'll continue to log reports as I get them. No, oh, that was a waste. Um, which is the most recent one? I'm not sure though. Patient attack. Dr. Mark Casian, at 1547, patient Jonathan Wills was admitted after complaining of insomnia and nausea. According to the nurse, Mr. Wills was calm and exhibited no signs of disorder when he was. Well, sorry if this is boring. I'm just trying to find a code for this. However. By the time I reached him at 10 after 4, his personality had changed dramatically. When I entered the room, Mr. Wills lunged at me with a scalpel he apparently stole from a supply drawer. With the assistance of an orderly, we managed to subdue and sedate him without injury. Mr. Wills was heavily medicated and could not be diagnosed, but in the 20 minutes he was left unattended, he managed to carve three symbols in his arm and cut his own tongue into two halves. Ooh. I, I can only guess at the cause of his problems. I hope that additional psychiatrists arrive soon. In the meantime, in response to this assault, all medical supplies and armaments will be locked in a secure hospital cabinet with the code 347. There we go. Dr. Casey and out. Oh, yes. I, I, I feel bad for that guy. If he slit his tongue into two... Slithering half snake things, mate. His fucking girlfriend's gonna love that. Could you imagine? Shit! And there's someone else. A mercenary. Oh, hmm. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, this is, come on, this is, this is ridiculous. And I need to reload, I didn't see that. And there's nothing left in there. Oh, man. That could have gone a whole lot better. gonna say what on earth is that Let's slow your ass down he died comfortably All right we can't go that way clearly right so, yeah, okay. A trained marine couldn't get that guy off him. You absolutely suck, sir. Uh, 
can't access there. Video link up requested. What's in here? Video link up requested. What we got? Armor. Ammunition. Can we get in there? Enter access code. No, we can't. That's a bit of a bummer. Marine comm center. Marine. I can't believe you're still alive. I'm unable to return to Mars City. All passages out of the Delta complex have been blocked. I'm setting up a command post here. I can monitor status reports of the entire base from Delta Central Authority and communicate with other Marine teams. It's your mission to link up with Bravo team and get that transmission sent. Head toward Alpha Lab. It's the fastest way to find them. I'll update your PDA security clearance from here. Good job. And good luck, Marine. Thank you. But can you upgrade my PDA so I can access every door in the complex ever? Instead of just some, please. No, that still needs a passcode though, doesn't it? That was a PDA in there. Actually, I wonder if we can... Shit. Fuck. That was a... I'm sure that was around here, though. Yeah, can we perhaps get through like this? Oh, we can. I actually thought we'd get burnt to a crisp, but hey. Download Bill Tyson PDA. Let's have a listen to see if that code for that door's on here. General Troop Morale, Troop Deployments. Audio report on Troop Morale. Morale here is beginning to drop. It's nothing to worry about yet since I keep my Marines sharp and ready to go. But events at the base are wearing on the troops. There have been a lot of things happening here on the base. I believe the UAC experiments being performed here must be the cause. Out here, they could be experimenting on God knows what. There are quite a few people missing. And no Marines, of course. It's the civilian population I am referring to. Bottom line, whatever it is they have going on here has my men on a racer's edge. At this point, Didn't there's expect no cause that to happen. for alarm, but I am requesting we rotate squads every 90 days instead of every 180. I will continue to report as the situation develops. It is good we have the new Marines en route. Fresh faces will help. Sergeant Tyson, out. So there was nothing on that one. Let's have a listen to his second recording. Audio report confirming new troop deployments for the Mars City Marine Facility, October 30th, 2145. The new troops will be arriving within a few days. I've started a series of training exercises focusing on close quarter small weapons combat, as well as instituting mandatory refresher courses on all munitions and weapons in our armory. In response to the large number of security breaches and general feelings of ill will around the base, I've doubled security details, placing two Marines at each checkpoint. This additional presence should help calm things down. Where the fuck did he go? that the incoming Marines are not quite as green as the last deployment. They've turned out okay, but some combat experience will go a long way right now. Sergeant Tyson, out. No, so that was kind of a waste of time, bugger. Mind you, it was worth checking because you don't know really. What? Oh man, really? Oh, fuck, there's another one. It's kind of best to let these guys come for you because you've seen what happens if you don't. Health pack. I didn't, don't know if I needed it. I didn't really look at my health, but it was there, so screw it. Oh. Before you got a shot off, bitch. I'm not entirely sure if this is the way we want to be going, but... I hate it when there's multiple routes you can take, because it's like, well, which one? PDA in there, I think. 
I think I saw one. There is another guy. I thought so. And another one. Wow. Reload quickly, please. Very quickly, please. There we go. Plenty of armor. Yes, let us have flashlight battles. Armor that we don't actually need, okay? Marine, if you run across any operational sentry bots, use them. Those guys pack a lot of firepower. Ah. Oh. Who's that? If you go to that games machine there, before you go to see Sergeant Kelly for the first time, you can actually play on it. It's pretty cool. It's just like a little retro game. Shit, which way was we going? The UAC is here to help you. Oh, wow. Psychological services are free. Oh, fucking hell. <sighs> Fuck me. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Fucking hell. Oh man. If I actually needed to physically shit, then it would have just come out, I'm telling you now. That was horrible. That got me good. That's likely to probably be the biggest jump in this game. Fuck. Oh, it's you. And you're not hostile, so that's good. Let him do the work. Save ammunition. Oh, another one. Alright, we'll give you a hand then. There's a lot of marines around. Marine, you gotta get to Bravo team quickly. They need all the firepower they can get. Sending that transmission is critical to our survival. I can only go so fast, mate. There's monsters and shit everywhere. What's in here? Don't have the right PDA anyway. So he keeps finding people to... Oh, shit! Oh! Cheeky fish. Where are they? I can hear them. Oh, wow! I don't remember them in the, in the original Dooms being able to teleport. But if they can, it just shows how long it's been since I've played them, really. It's a PDA. Duncan Matthews. No, he's got no audio logs. Fair enough. Administration. I think that's where we're heading to. Administration. Yes. I'm really enjoying this so far. Such a good game. It really is. But that jump. Oh, man. Ow. <laughs> Beating my desk now. 
Yeah, that jump was something else. I don't think you understand, Dr. Petruger. No, I understand everything. I'm telling you now, Doctor, the UAC is taking over this operation. Operation? Is that what you're calling it? The situation is out of control. It's not out of control, Swan. You are. I'll manage this, and you and your flunky will be taking control of nothing. Do you understand? Yes, Petruger. I think I do understand. Okay, plan B. Oh, fuck. See, so, yeah, the, the dude with the green is Sergeant Kelly. I'm not sure who the guy with the glasses is. to the Alpha Labs, formerly designated Phase 1 by the Union Aerospace Offworld Research Division. The Alpha Labs oh. began construction on October 29, 2095, and became fully operational July 17, 2130. Originally Where? Right there. And these guys need to calm down. I don't know if I have grenades. Use that for the sake of 10 health. Where? Because those, it doesn't upgrade you one at a time, it upgrades you 10 at a time. So if I use that now for the sake of one health, it'll take 10 off of that, so it's not worth it. What was that PDA we just got? I might have a code for that locker. No audio logs, so that'll be a no. Huh. Shells, though. So. We haven't got the right access for that yet. Shit. Oh, I hate it when they jump at you like that. I knew he was going to pounce because of the position he was in, so. That's why I didn't make me jump or anything. Cheeky fucker. You have to watch your back all the time because there could be so much shit. Don't stop, buddy. There's nothing you can do for me. They're all gone. Surprised us. They just came out of nowhere. Can I put you out of your misery? Or anything? When do I got access to that either? Denied. Locate the PDA of William Banks. Right. Um, because that's not freaky. PDA of William Banks. Can we get through here? We can, using the old jump crouch trick. Any old school gamers will know what I mean. That was pointless then. Nowhere else we can go. No, there really isn't. It sounds like Medusa, man. Oh, fuck. Hiding out corners and shit. Security armor. So we got some armor and stuff. But still not quite what we need. Um... Hmm. 
No. Right. Do we need to backtrack a bit then? <laughs> Fuck's sake. That explains it, bugger. Oh, take it, you slag. Take it. Uh. Flashing lights. I don't do flashing lights. I don't do darkness either. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Uh. Right, there's a door there, so I couldn't exactly move to the left. You bitch, you took one damage. Feel the might of my shotgun. This is where they just were a moment ago. What? Oh. I thought I heard some pit pattering around. Oh, shit. Right, um, if you get up, restricted access, shotgun, health pack, armor, security override, don't mind if I do. Oh, fuck, I remember this guy. He's not that hard to beat, actually, but it's not the point. Shit. Ooh. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. He ain't gonna get up, is he? Fuck. Uh. Fuck. There you go. Three shots. Now I heard. Yeah. Jumping all over my shit, bitch. Let's fucking watch you get. 